And our inquiry question is when students are provided with cross-curricular project-based learning opportunities, how would they model 21st century skills? So to give you a little bit of a background, about uh, 14 months ago, I was facing the loss of teaching in Geography 12 due to a lack of enrollment. Allison was facing the loss of adventure tourism. And at the same time, I really wanted to get a social justice 12 course running at Couch and Secondary. From there, we went to our principal and uh, sort of explained this idea to him and, and said the magic words, pilot project. And he, uh, <laughs> he was like, yes, let's do it. And that's how gas came to be. We were given one block, second semester. The two of us were uh, allowed to teach in that one block together. Uh, the three subjects were all put in that one block. Uh, 47 students is what we've ended up with here at the end of the semester. What worked was really the curricular connections. It was great to see um, how students embrace this idea that these subjects were connected. And when you go to school and you go to different classes, you're not just learning discrete bits of information that don't have anything else to do with, say, the next class that you're going to. So that was very exciting for us. There was lots of demonstration through these projects of those 21st century skills, so creativity, collaboration, communication. Um, it was really exciting for us. Okay, so where are we going from here? Um, GAS is running again next year, second semester, so we'll be teaching it again. And then the big picture for where we're going with this course, well, Diane and I are both new to project-based learning, and we did some um, work online with the Buck Institute, and we did some classroom visits to High Tech High and people that are real experts in project-based learning. So we're working on that, and we're working on becoming more competent with PBL. And then we also want to figure out how to get more of the students enrolled in those courses to take advantage of these opportunities to earn more credits and get away from just focusing on, we probably had half the students or just under half take advantage of the, you know, achieving sort of six or eight credits, but how do we get more students doing that? Because it's a really valuable thing for them. So that's where we're at for next year.